Okay, this is a follow-up video to the first video I made on how to open .deal files and the reason why you probably don't want to open a .deal file. It was a question asked at mdrtech.co.uk slash answers, so I did answer it. The reason why I'm guessing most people want to open a .deal file is because they're getting a problem with their computer saying this particular file is not working. Um, so they try and open it and see if they can work out the problem, which is not going to happen. But to fix a .deal file error, it's actually quite simple. I will put a link to this video, or this particular website I mean, below in the video description. I also will put a text version of how to do all this at my blog, link will be below. So first of all you need to head over to this website. Um, you can search by alphabetical order of the file you're looking for, or just type it in here. So I'm going to go ahead and pretend that I've got a problem with my computer. So I'm going to go ahead and download this file. So now I'm going to download the file, which is the download link here. And this is the lame.dil file. So once I've got the file, I need to find where it is on my computer. So you can right click on it, or double click on it, and it will, if you have WinRAR installed, which you should have by now, um, you can extract the two. I'm going to put it on my desktop. You also get a README file which does tell you how to open or repair your file on your the deal file on your computer. Basically, what it does tell you is to go to my computer, C drive, and so on. So I'm going to show you how to do that now. So you go to my computer, and yours will be C drive, not a boot camp. And go to Windows, and it may ask you to go up here to um, show files in this uh, particular location because you're not meant to be in this folder. Then find a folder called System32, which is that one. You can use the keyboard to um, quickly find it. And if you keep scrolling down, you should find loads of .dil files here. So you should be able to find the lame file on my computer if it does exist. So let's go have a quick look. I don't think this will exist on my computer. So what you do is once you're on that section, on the DIL file itself, right click, click copy, and then paste onto this folder. And it will ask you, you need administration uh, privileges. If you don't have administrative privileges, you have to get someone else who does to do this. Then you press continue. I'm not going to do that on this computer because I don't want to mess up my computer. But if that file wasn't going to be copied on your computer or say it's being used or something is similar, if you grab the file, click rename, just add something random on the end of this file, and then click it and save it, and then try and copy and paste the file again, and it will then override that file and let you use it or copy it to the computer. That's basically how you open a, a repair a problem with a .deal file. If you can't find the .deal file you're looking for, you can head over to mdrtech.co.uk answers and post a question there and we will help you find that deal file for your computer. Don't forget you can follow me on Google Plus and Twitter, links will be below. Hope you found this video useful. If you've got a question you can ask it at mdrtech.co.uk answers. You can also find us talking tech 24 7 7 days a week at mdrtech.co.uk blog. Until next time.